<laughs> it's there. Dude, it's right there. Hey, welcome back to the Punch Kids. Welcome back to Sonic Underwater Special. So, Sonic the Underwater. Lo- video Lord game. of the Rings, The Lost Tales. <laughs> you get it? Tales? Oh, man. T-A-I-L-S. Incredible. Oh, man. Was that a good joke, Joe? It was. Um, hey, DT. Yeah. Have you seen the... Okay, so, well, sorry, backspace. Mm-hmm. Um, the reason I want to play this was because of all the new Sonic the Hedgehog announcements. Yeah. Happened, I think it was last week. Sure. Have you seen anything? Nothing. Nothing. Zero. zero. Literally zero. Cool. If I wasn't friends with you, I'd have no idea that there was a Sonic the Hedgehog announcement at all. Okay. So, interesting things happened. Yeah. Tell me about it. They, which kind of goes into our previous conversation on, on the last episode. Mm-hmm. Talking about the video that I created, blah, blah, yeah. blah, blah. Um, so, they announced a new game that goes back to this era to like the retro yeah pretty much exactly what this is okay um which I really wanted to talk about mm-hmm. when it first came out and Dave you can vouch for this like I, I, I contacted Dave I was like dude we gotta do a Sonic the Hedgehog video because I have heaps to talk about yeah you know I wanna I wanna do it like super quick blah 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 yeah um and I wanted to talk about Okay, sorry, backspace again. There's there two yeah. announcements. The first announcement was uh, an old game like this, mm-hmm. going back to going back to the roots. Mm-hmm. And the second game was an announcement called Project Sonic, which was PS for short. <laughs> yeah, which was uh, Sonic Generations Two. So, Dave, if you don't know Sonic Generations, it's Sonic. oh, I know Sonic Generations. Yeah, yeah. So no, I have no idea. I'm okay. kidding. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> um, so they so they did a game called uh, Sonic Generations, where mm-hmm. it was like the new like twenty like two th- what do you, what do you even call it? I, let's call it modern Sonic. Okay, where it looks kind of a bit more badass, and he's got longer spikes and green eyes and buckles on his shoes. Sure, like- and he has a, has a voice actor connected to it. Yeah, right. And, and then there's Class, oh. They call it classic Sonic, which is this Sonic who yeah. doesn't talk, and you know he's just kind of like the silent protagonist. I totally know that Sonic. I I like to look at that Sonic as like, like tween Sonic, like yeah, Sonic for f- Sonic for the um, the agitated twelve year old. Dude, it's it's the worst thing ever. Like the, <laughs> the, the like the design is is great. Like yeah. the design the design is completely fine. Yeah, but it's it's the attitude and the voice acting that goes with it. It's just. This is the complete turn. He, he's kind of like Bart Simpson, but like ten years a little bit too late. Yeah, yeah, that's it, man. Um, and, and this is what I wanted to talk about. So, like, the fact that some, something was just off about the original Sonic Generations, mm-hmm. um, because they were actually calling it Modern Sonic and Classic Sonic. Right. And the premise is that you're Modern Sonic, but then suddenly Classic Sonic turns up and helps mm-hmm. you to fight the bad guys okay so you kind of control these two sonics you do level so level by level is that canon is that like is there actually two sonics well well dude this is exactly what i was about to talk about oh, okay like, well now there is yeah um and it just like it the game was it was praised pretty well but dude i just hated before it came concept. out what was that sorry the game was praised before it came out no, 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 no. So, like, so- Sonic Gen- Generations has already come out. Oh, it's already out, like, 20, yeah, 2010. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Was. Yeah, I'm with you. Um, but, so, the announcement of Project Sonic was, like, the second installment of yeah, that, okay. that, like, yeah. uh, theme. Yeah. Um, and, yeah, so they're calling it Classic Sonic, Sonic and Modern Sonic. And it just... It's this fourth wall-breaking gimmick mm. that completely for me destroys any magic there is sure so I, I see what they're trying to do they're trying to connect the new and old generations mm-hmm. right so there's the older generation who love this stuff so like pretty much me I love the classics yeah just cause they're they great great games mm-hmm. it still kind of has attitude but it's in the gameplay mm-hmm. you know in, in, in his sprite animation oh shit um you know so, so like you just wait for a bit and he'll do like the waiting foot 
Oh, really? I don't think. Uh, you know sure. what I mean? Like, he's got attitude, but it's all, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. all in the sprites, you know? It's all communicated through, mm -hmm. uh, like, visually. Mm -hmm. But then you have the new generation of Sonic, which is all about the voice and too cool for school and attitude and it's like... Yeah, right. Which, which Sonic had that before, but it was through, like, third party um, property. So it was mm -hmm. in the cartoons, they gave him a voice <laughs> and, and that was fine because it wasn't, it wasn't canon, you know? Yeah. Like, it was these extra little things on the side that kind of added to the universe mm -hmm. on, like, a fan level. Mm -hmm. But but then they started they started to put it into the game and it was just like it just isn't working and, and yeah. so Sonic Generations essentially for me was like instead of just leaving the old Sonic where it lay yeah they tried to bring it back and drew attention to the fact that it was a different era you know it, there were yeah sure. And it was kind of this time. Sorry, man. I'm just like talking to you about no, this because I'm like passionate about. You it. are very passionate about it. <laughs> yeah, go on. Um, so it was kind of happening in this time where like games started to be super meta, mm -hmm. drawing attention to the fact that they were video games. Yeah. So like, if anyone's played uh, Banjo Kazooie Nuts and Bolts, um, did you you play Banjo Kazooie? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you play Nuts and Bolts? Uh, is that the? S it was like the. That? 360 version it was like uh, Microsoft bought Rare I actually probably did and then uh, it was all about um, like the characters character designs changed yeah and yeah yeah, just yeah. kind of more like a squarish yep look and then that you had to make was, I hated it yeah dude right and you had to make cars yeah, and yeah. You know, vehicles or whatever so there's this character called uh, Cog King of Games or, or like um or something like that and he, he rocks up and he's he's essentially keeps reminding you the player mm -hmm. that you're playing a video game yeah so he starts out alright Banjo Kazooie you have to you have to do this mission and then puts out all these um, musical notes just like the old games yeah and like, yeah and they're like scattered everywhere and then you start collecting a few and then he pauses the game he's like mm. wait do you actually think I would um make you do all these collectibles like that's not what the kids want anymore more blah 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 blah. yeah sure so it's been super meta and like keeps drawing your attention to the fact that you're playing a game i don't think that's necessarily bad but no uh, dude no way like yeah Metal Gear solid does it all the time you know like it's yeah but it was just like really saturated that mm. the, the whole theme was that you're the player you're not you're not actually banjo because i think it's like it's like forced comedy like it's kind of like the maybe the developers thought every time we break the fourth wall, it'll just automatically be funny yeah, or entertaining. Exactly. Where it's like not like yeah. the novelty of fourth wall breaking wears off really quickly. Yeah. If it's not done well. Totally. Um, dude, the best example for me was um. Do you ever see Into the Wild that movie? Yeah. So. Where he eats the apple. He eats the apple and he looks straight into the camera. And I was loving that movie until that moment. Dude. And then that was the moment where I was like, I don't like this movie anymore. Oh my gosh. I'm exactly the same. Oh, really? Yeah, dude. <laughs> it was like, it completely... You like, oh, like, thanks. So you reminded me that none of this is true. Dude, 100%. For no reason. 100%. <laughs> it was... Like that that moment happened, yeah. and then for the next like half an hour, I could not think about anything else except, except that like, happening. yeah, you just dude, I love that you said that. <laughs> um, yeah, it was the worst. I hated it, dude. And but it, yeah, like, yeah. So this two second scene ruined the movie <laughs> for me. <laughs> like just literally a, two seconds. Yeah, just like a an ex, like a look. Yeah. Um, oh man, that was awesome. Uh, okay, yeah. So bring the fourth wall. Yeah, it can be done well. But so basically, what Sonic did by bringing in classic Sonic to help modern Sonic, yeah, was just like this isn't the way that it should go. Like Sonic's about adventure; he's the good guy killing Robotnik; he's the bad guy. Yeah, it's just getting too complicated, you know. Like it's when I think the appeal was was simplicity, um, and it just became Sega just being too self aware, you know, yeah. like. Just trying to do too much instead of just keeping it simple. Um, and so when this new announcement came out of like the second game in that in that series, mm -hmm. there's a lot of love for it because everyone loved Generations. 
Yeah. But for me, it's just like, what are you guys doing? Like, what? What is this? It's just. Yeah. It's just not the right move, you know? Yeah. Sorry, man. Uh, I know you can't really chime in, but like. I don't. Yeah. Like. I don't care, though. Yeah. (laughs) I'm just listening. Um, yeah, that's 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 kind of what I'm feeling. It's just like, the, see, like the retro move, yeah, was amazing, yeah. But like continuing with being super meta and self-aware, mm. where's the adventure, man? Like, where's yeah, where's good old? <laughs> <laughs> it's there, dude. It's right there. Yeah, right there on the spikes. All right, guys. Well, look, we might call it here. Yeah, cool. And then hit. Hit it up in the next episode. Sweet ass cuz. Also known as episode three. Phantom right. Pain. <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn it. Phantom Menace? Wait, is oh, that yeah, episode yeah. two? Hang on. We were on Star Wars now? Yeah. What episode, episode three, three was, uh, Reve- no. Revenge of the Sith? Revenge of the Sith? Phantom Menace? Revenge of the Sith. And the second one was, uh. Which ones? What was it called? Clone something? Attack of the Clones, yeah, nice. Um, <coughs> I'm sorry for that. Anyway, call. whatever. All right. Um, sorry about my ranting, everybody. No, don't be. Let don't, me know in the comments if you feel the same. Don't apologize for your like for, my for your passion, man. Yeah. Because people watching this game, like, let's be real, like, of all the people involved in this video, from the production of it to. The watching of it, I will probably be the only one that doesn't like Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> so, like... <laughs> everyone else is going to be like, yeah, man, I totally agree. Or I disagree, and yeah. this is why. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'll be like, hey, guys, you watch... You watch the New York Rangers game? <laughs> New York Rangers. The Rangers game? The Rangers match? The Rangers? The Rangers? The Rangers? Um, the Rangers? Or the Swans game? Hey, if you're American... I don't know if I should just be tacking this onto the end of a video, but if you're American and you want to watch the AFL with me, you should. I'd be so keen. And yeah, do you reckon they get AFL? That surely it's America, right? You can probably find it somewhere. Like wait, is, like Americans have everything? Is that what you're saying? I'm saying like I'm saying Americans have access to many things. Yeah. Right. Um. So and I might cut this episode up with yeah. like footage of the trailers and stuff. Mm. Make it a bit of a thing. What do you reckon? I or just keep it normal. I'm not allowing it. Okay. No, of course you can, man. I think that's a great idea. Okay. It'll give me, especially. I'll get to watch this episode again, and I'll get visual cues. Oh yeah. Um, Sweet as man. That was clever what they did with that pillar as well. It was like, right. They yeah. just flip. You flip you on one side, then the other, and it makes makes it appear that you're doing something cool. Do you know what I mean? The illusion of speed, Dave. The illusion of cool, I was going to say. Uh, it's not really the illusion of speed, it was speed. It was illusion of cool. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to tell you, and you're not listening to me. <laughs> I've said it three times. <laughs> um, oh, Sorry, Dave, for not you've listening. Got a, um, you've, got a, you've got a star. I've got an invincibility guy. Nope. Oh, yeah. Alright. Nope. I've got a, um, I'm, I've got a su- Sonic design suggestion, and I'm going to tell you in the next episode. Okay. Alright. Alright, bye everyone. Hey guys, bye-bye. Bye.